being engaged in this process and for giving all of us the opportunity to meet y'all. Um, I have not had the opportunity to meet some of you this evening, so let me tell you a little bit about myself. Of course, my name is Dustin Burroughs. I was born and raised in Lubbock. I uh, graduated from Monterey High School, went off to school for a little bit, uh, came back and got two degrees from Texas Tech at JD and an MBA. My wife, Elizabeth, is here in the audience, my best friend, loved my life. Uh, we have two young boys, a one-year-old and a three-year-old. Uh, like many young parents, we're faced with the decision of how we're going to educate our children, whether we're going to send them to traditional public education, whether we're going to homeschool them, or whether we're going to send them to a Christian private school. And that's a burden, a financial burden on the middle class. I'm glad we have the choices we do, but I hope the legislature in 2015 will consider providing more choice and opportunity for parents like us. Uh, my parents are also in the audience. Um, I work with my father. I've done that for 10 years. Uh, we practice law together. He's taught me what it has meant to be a representative. He's taught me it starts with listening to your clients because you don't know everything. He's taught me you've got to communicate with them all the time. Keep them informed. Don't have them come looking for you. And to zealously advocate for them. And never, never overpromise them and underdeliver. Make sure it's the other way around. The last four years, he and I have done agricultural litigation. We have a special tie to the ag community. Is the farmers we represent, three to four hundred of them currently. And from that, I know that these gentlemen and these women who paid for their land, paid for the right to tap the water, and I see that people are trying to take that property right away from them, and it disappoints me. I pledge to each of you, if I'm given the opportunity to be your state representative, I will not passively preside over the office, that I'll use every bit of my wit, my wisdom, my education, my training, and my energy to fight every single day Christian values and for freedom in the marketplace because marketplace